Hey, what's going on everyone? Today we're going to be virtualizing Ubuntu Linux using Parallels Desktop on the M1 MacBook Pro. Let's begin. So what we have here is the file manager. So we can open it up and we have our major folders such as desktop documents, downloads, etc. And we also have other locations where we can click on the computer and have access to the root of the drive, as you can see. Such as if we go into boot, we have our major starter files, including the kernel. The next thing that we're going to test out is how well the internet performs. So we're going to use Firefox and we're going to look at this cold and Mac article. So we can do a bit of scrolling and so far it's almost totally smooth, similar to how smooth it is on Windows 10 ARM when you use Parallels. So I think in this situation, it's good enough as a daily driver environment. Now we're going to see how well a YouTube video performs. So this is a 1080p video. Now let's begin. So right now it doesn't say any frames have dropped so far. And we'll let it play for another 10 seconds. So overall, it doesn't say a single frame has dropped, which is really, really good. The next video that we're going to try out is the PS5 boot animation when you turn it on for the first time. And this was actually recorded by Tillman Domination, so feel free to give him a follow. Let's try it out. So it should be 1080p 60fps. Turns out zero frames have dropped at all. Now there's absolutely zero lag. Zero frames dropped out of 1178. I'd say that's very impressive for an ARM64 virtual machine. So now that's done, we're going to be taking a look at LibreOffice Writer, which is like the Linux equivalent of Microsoft Word. So we can write in, this is a test of Ubuntu 20 running on Parallels using an M1 Mac. And we can just copy that, make it bold. And we can also try and make it multiple times. So yeah, that's LibreOffice Writer. Then we're going to take a quick look at Solitaire, which is over here. We have our ace. We can put the eight here and the seven. We can also have another ace here and a third ace. I missed a six. We can put a six here and a nine here, etc. Next up, we're gonna do a little bit of Sudoku. I'm just guessing right now. We can also open up our calendar app where it shows the current date. We can set it to year, week, you can put in reminders. 
We can open up Mahjong. So there's like multiple different options here. So last but not least, we have the calculator app. So we have five different modes. We have the basic mode, advanced calculator, financial calculator, so such as if we want to do currency conversions, five Australian dollars is around three euros. You also have the programming mode and keyboard mode, which you could use to like convert degrees to gradients and multiple other conversions such as if you want to convert Celsius degrees Celsius to Fahrenheit. So five degrees Celsius is around 41 Fahrenheit. So that was Ubuntu Linux running on the M1 Mac using Parallels desktop. If you have any questions, leave them in the comment section. Thank you all for watching and see you all in my next video.